Alright, so we are here in Denver, Colorado. It was in the world. We're sitting here with the turf DJ, DJ K Tone, if you don't know. Tell us a little bit about yourself, man. Oh, man. Turf DJ, man, Denver, Colorado, man. Independent artists up, man. I mean, not even just from Denver, man, from everywhere, man. I'm from the rich, Mr. Fat KC, man. I'm from the KC. Full of dirty work for KC. I'm from the dirty work for KC. Not to fool with Ron Ron. Oh, my goodness. Ron Ron and Ron Ron. Oh, man. Ron Ron is the good. So that's what, that's what we're doing, man. Yeah. So, I mean, I know you got, I don't want to run you through, but you got a list of projects as you I mean, just an estimation, how many mixtapes you think you put out? Estimation? I mean, because I know it's a lot. Yeah, at least 50. At least. Because I'm no, telling you what. More than 50. I'm telling you what, I, every record store I went to around here, there's a K Tone section. Yeah. It's not like one little rope, it's a K Tone section. You don't just see that. You know what I'm saying? So. <laughs> what kind of projects you got lined up in the future? Man, I got, I got, I got a couple of projects, man. I got, right now, I'm working on, uh, all I do, I do these, I do my radio mixes for serious shot, right? And I do a mix for the experience. And I break them down on the mix tape. So it's called Core DJ Radio, one of the Core DJs. It's Core DJ Radio. See, what I do is, I got the, I got the, Sirius Satellite Radio Show, Core DJ Radio, Shade 45, XM 66. And what I do is, I do the, I do the mixes, you know what I'm saying? And I break them down in the mixtape form. So if you didn't hear the show, it's good to get the mixtape, Core DJ Radio. I do the same thing for, for uh, the, the station of Colorado Springs, 96.1 The Beat. Go back out the old school album. And that mixtape is called Deep in the Crates. You know what I'm saying? We take it back to the old school man, the hip hop. Real hip hop, like hip hop classics, like Run GMC, LFPJ, like a lot of people like that right now, man. Cause you know, man, you know, sometimes, man, the music, the music right now, man. So a lot of people, a lot of people's feeling that. Right. I got another project coming with Young Go. I got another one coming with Dirty Work in KC. Man, I got a lot of things. How'd you end up even started being a DJ? How'd that come about, man? Man, really? I started in 99 when I first got to college. I went to Lincoln University of Missouri. And like my first month in school, I was on the radio. You know what I'm saying? I was on the radio. That's really what got me started in the DJ field. And a lot of people was asking me, like, man, what you do my part of? I'm like, you know what I do my part of? Started doing parties, but my cousin was a DJ. DJ Criminal from Philly, one of the criminal. He, he a DJ for real. I went, out, you know, I went out there my I went out there my freshman year, matter of fact. Went out there my freshman year. You know what I'm saying? He was just real nice with the, with the turntable. So I'm like, man, you know, I'm on radio. I'm like, man, I need to. He was like, man, don't even trip. You get back, I'm gonna send you the turntable. He sent me the turntable. He didn't teach me though. I didn't, he didn't even show me nothing. He like, man, I'm gonna just send it to you. Man, I had to sit in there. I had to learn there. I was kind of whack. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, he sent me the turntable. I worked on them things. Got good. So, you know, you linked up, you linked up with Jack. It's cool, man. I met Jack. I met Jack a minute ago in Cali. Like one of my first, it wasn't one of my first mixtapes, bro. Yeah, it wasn't one of my first mixtapes. It was probably like number ten or whatever. It was like, but one of the first ones I, I got from somebody to host. He hosted my mixtape. Don't even know if told me this part two. You know what I'm saying? And I, I mean, shit, I had already played. Matter of fact, I had already, I was already playing with Jack. When I was at Lincoln, a song called Hey Boy. You know what I'm saying? That everybody loves now. But I was playing that, I didn't even know who Jack was. I don't even remember how I got the record. I got the record. Sir, I got the record from the radio station. They never played it. I'm like, Jack, I didn't even know he was from the Bay. I didn't know none of it. Right. But I seen him with Jack. 
I played that thing. It was on my very first mixtape. Hey girl, it was on my very first mixtape. Very first one I ever did in life. My uh, street mix by the one. He was on. I, I put that on my mixtape because I liked it. I didn't know. I didn't know who it was. Right. So I got the chance to meet him. Like, oh, okay, yeah. You know, we just like he appreciated. Right. Like, nigga, like it was just awesome world because I, I really didn't know who he was. I didn't know. You know what I'm saying? None of that. And I, then I got the phone. I'm like, okay, that's, Put two and two together. Right. Okay. Shit, man. Anything else you want to talk about? Yeah, yeah. Whatever, whatever you want to know. What else you want to know? Anything else you want to know? Man, uh, shit, y'all either missing your friend projects, man, for real. Like, just hit the face with the contact information. Whatever. Contact me. Business. Man. All that. All business, man. 720 Still living the lead at gmail.com. I got a PR person too. Hold on, I'm gonna give you an info. I'm gonna give you an info. Hold on. Hold on. I'm gonna give you my, my publicist info. So you can get with her, right? Because look, we're doing it. We're doing it for real. MidnightPR at gmail.com, man. Hit my publicist, man. Get on me, man. Get up on me. DJKTone.com. I'm everywhere, man. Wherever you at, that's where I'm at. I'm, I'm wherever you at. Just get with me. Hey, he came all the way to Denver, man. From KC to do interviews. I know he got some more questions, man. Man, what's up? Any more questions? Whatever. He was in the club. He was in the club.